Hello everyone, Burrito here again with another Smite video. Think of this video as the last movie in a trilogy similar to these classics. Now my original plan for this video was going to be a more in-depth look into Smite as a game, the community surrounding it, and what truly sets it apart from this competition. But who would want to watch that? So instead, you're getting this. Bro, don't be scared, boy. You are literally a tank. That's why Anubis is in garbage. Before we can talk about what it's like to play Smite, we must first ask ourselves, what is Smite? Well, Smite, by definition, is a free-to-play, third-person, multiplayer online battle arena developed and published by hi -Rez. But us in the Smite community know it by its real definition, and that's broken. In this game, you can have a Sobek dash, pluck a Kepri while the Kepri is grabbing him. But for some reason, Rama can't see through walls when he's ulting. Certain skins can give you advantages and disadvantages, and then there's Anubis. This is why Anubis is broken, dude. I, I like, didn't even have to wrap either of them. And they surrendered. <laughs> I mean, you know. <laughs> but of course, it doesn't matter how broken the game is because you'll probably never find a match. I found matches in Gotham City Imposters faster than I have in Smite. Because <laughs> I'm totally there's down like, for that. There's, there's like oh shit, am I in a match? Oh, whoa. <laughs> What's happening? Uh, I didn't think this was real. Uh, <laughs> and at least there, shit like this doesn't happen. Dang, I thought I actually hit that rap right there. But who even needs it? Who even needs the rap? <laughs> Dude, if you're now it's not all bad. Sometimes you have moments like this. Oh my God. Oh, that's An enemy has been bested. Good kill. Oh, it's... Wow, he really walked into all of his teammates like that. <laughs> Got him. Oh my god, here comes a Gev. Well, I got it. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> the whole team came over here. But more often than not, you get moments like this. Anyway, Smite is an ever-changing game that allows for diversity in god and item selection. The game itself is ever-evolving. One season, a god can be a viable asset to a team, and then the next day, the god is completely unplayable because of one item. Then the next day after that, that god's kit has been completely reworked. This aspect of Smite is what really keeps the game fresh after years, and adds an extra layer of depth to really suck you into the game. Smite is a game you either love or you hate, or love to hate. And oftentimes it gets compared to games like League of Legends or Dota 2. But while it exists in the same genre as these games, it's not the same. The camera angle alone is enough to turn most people away. Unless you're playing a hunter, the cookie clicker aspect is almost non-existent. I mean, what would you rather play? This? Or this? Or the Medusa like that. It goes not. I'm gonna get up here. This is a triple right here. Okay. Now we got Ganesh behind us. Ah, that was bad. I should have paid more attention. Alright. Of course, the gameplay isn't perfect, but I think it's more to do with the game than the mechanics. I mean, how do you explain things like this? Completely dodged the opening. It hit me. 
What the fuck? Did you see that? So when people ask me what it's like to play Smite, I usually say, it's okay. Then this happens. That's so dumb.